Hello everyone, it's Robert with SparkFun Electronics and we have more new products this week. So let's go ahead and talk about them. First up, we've got these nice big seven segment displays. These actually have a nice little backpack on the back as you can see there. This is the open segment backpack and we have them in all these lovely different colors and it's a really nice backpack and really simple way to use these. It can accept SPI, I2C, basic serial, and you have your own Atmega 328 on there so you can program it to do your own stuff if you want. And we also even have a couple little jumpers over here. Um, we've got one that says counter and another one that says meter. The counter is really cool because if you close that jumper, when you feed this just a signal like a switch, it will just increment one. So you can use this for like a video game or something like that. And whenever you click or close that switch or whatever it is, it will just increment one, two, three, four, five. So if you don't want to have an actual microcontroller doing that, you can just have one of these connected to power and a little switch incrementing the numbers. And then we've also got the meter on there. And the meter is interesting because it just reads one of the um, inputs on here and just displays like the analog value. So it's a really simple way to use just this and an analog sensor to view the actual value of the analog sensor. And I've got one hooked up right here to show you. So there you go, that is an orange. This is the green, this is actually running that little analog sketch. There's nothing connected to it, so it's kind of jumping all around. That's the red. There's the white. And finally, we've got the blue. And next, we've got a new version of the Mechanum wheels. Um, if you're not familiar with the Mechanum wheels, we actually had a earlier version of these a little while ago. They're interesting in that they actually have these um, little rollers like a 45 degree angle to the main hub. The way that they work is if you have two of these wheels and you move them forward, you move forward. If you move them back, you move back. But if you move them inside of each other, they'll actually move out or in. So this way you can have a robot that not only moves forward and backward, but can actually strafe side to side or even move diagonally in all directions. We have a demonstration of an older model of this that we used. Here's the older model, and you can see the difference between the two. So the new ones actually have a metal hub, um, this nice metal connector there, and they're all pressed metal. And the old ones had this small problem because you had these two separate rollers and there was really no bearing system inside here, so they tended to rub a little bit, and they weren't that smooth. These new ones actually are a lot smoother, and they actually use a single little roller instead of the split design. So these actually run a lot better. We're actually working on a demo for these. We didn't have enough time to do it this week, and quite frankly, we want to do it right. We actually want to use some kind of encoder on the wheel for a feedback system so that we can make sure all the wheels are moving exactly the speed that we want to. So it's gonna take us a little bit of time to get that together, but we are working on a demo with these to do it properly. Um, if you do wanna try these out, keep in mind that you're gonna to wanna to have some kind of feedback system. When we first tried it with these old ones, the problem that we ran into is that we weren't using any feedback system and we were just driving with a gear motor. And unless those front and back are turning at the exact same rate, it kind of chattered and shifted a little bit. So you really want to drive those at exactly the same rate. And the best way to do that is with some kind of encoder or something like that. So we're going to be working on a demo of these. Give us a couple weeks to kind of um, put that together and figure out the best way to drive these. But check out the demo of these in the future. So there you have it. This is our Friday product post for this week. We've got the Mechanum wheels with a demo hopefully coming up with the next couple weeks. And we've got the new tall open segment, seven segment displays in the five different colors. Um, so hope there's something that interests you here. As always, check out the rest of the new product post for more new products, and we'll see you again next week.